today I'm going to give you five tips of how you can maintain your hair healthier. So I have this beautiful yellow rose because it's springtime even though it doesn't feel like it. But we want to let Mother Nature know that we New Yorkers are ready for good weather. And again, I am not a professional. These are just things that I do that work for me that I've tried over the years and I've experimented so many things in my hair and I feel like Wait. must trim your hair. I trim my hair approximately every three weeks, three to four weeks, sometimes if I remember every three weeks if not once a month. But you don't have to get fancy scissors, nothing crazy. I have this regular pair, they were probably like 15 bucks or so and I got them at the beauty supply, anyone can get them. If you want to get something fancier, that's fine too, but you just take a little bit of your hair and you just trim just a little bit, about probably about an inch I trim. And that's just to get rid of all the split ends so they don't spread throughout my hair. And this actually helps your hair grow, so get your scissors. Shampoo and conditioner. This is very important. Now, I've used tons and tons of different conditioners and shampoos, but lately I've been using these babies right here and I got them again at the beauty supply and they're called silicone mix shampoo bamboo so the shampoo here it says um, contains bamboo extract a natural product to regenerate and nourish the hair and silicones to smooth and give shine and this smells a little funny I must say not bad funny just funny or just not what I'm used to but it does the job, I think. So the condition, the shampoo, I feel like it really cleans my hair, and I got this at the beauty supply for five dollars. What a bargain! And then we have the conditioner, and it's not in a bottle. It's in this pot, and it looks. I don't know if you can see it, but it looks like this. And again, it smells a little different, but different is good. And this is also a little bit thicker than your regular conditioner. But I think this is really, really, really good, especially if you dye your hair as much as I do. A heat protecting spray. Now, this one that I have here is the Garnier Fructis Flat Iron Perfection. And this is supposed to be for straightening your hair, but honestly, I use it if I straighten my hair, if I curl my hair, I just put it right before I use any heat on my hair. <laughs> Biotin pills. Now, I know that a lot of girls go against this or don't want to use biotin pills because they don't want unwanted hair in unwanted areas, and that's totally understandable. But this, to me, is like gold. The one I have here is the Nature's Bounty Hair, Skin, and Nails. And it's 5,000 micrograms of biotin. Now this big pot has 250 coated caplets. And these capsules, or caplets as they call it, are pretty big. And they smell like vitamins. I don't like the smell, but they're like huge compared to like other pills. Take three caplets daily, preferably with meals. I only take two daily. I take one in the morning, right after breakfast, and then I take one in the evening, right after dinner. Me by a professional. That's right, this is just not me talking. My dermatologist recommended this because um, my hair was somewhat dry, well, my scalp really, and so he said these were great and I've been using them for probably two years. And so this, I can tell you honestly that after using these, I feel like my hair is stronger against all the damage that I do, all of it. And I mean heat, dyes, um, bleach, especially bleach. So, please, get them, get them, get them. <laughs> hair masks. Now, hair masks, you can get them at beauty supplies, at the pharmacy. Um, this one that I have here is called the Salon Conditioner for Extremely Damaged Hair. So, a hair mask is technically kind of like a conditioner. It usually comes in like a little packet like this, and it's a one-time use. And this is just to restore all the nutrients you kill when you dye your hair or when you use heat or all that stuff. But like especially, especially if you dye your hair. A bunch of brands. The one that I have here is called a High Pro Pack. This, what I do, I brush my hair. 
um, and I put this all over, all over, all of it, especially on the tips, which is where my hair gets mostly dry. I put it, then I put it in a bun, and then I wrap it with a bag or with a little cap, a plastic cap, something to, to maintain it, and I leave it for half an hour. Um, after you wash it, make sure you rinse it and you wash it well, you remove it all, and your hair is going to feel really greasy at the beginning, but trust me, this is a good sign. I hope this video was helpful for you guys, and I hope that this may help your hair get stronger and healthier and shinier and sexier. All for today, thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment. Don't forget to subscribe. Thumbs up. And all Let's